All right, guys. So my rain barrel is completely full. It hasn't rained for days, actually. I have to drain this almost daily just for the sump pump. So you can see I got this hooked up so I can kind of see my water level and kind of once we get here, it starts to spill out. As you can see, that's what this is. So on this side, I got the splitter and I got this reinforced hose for the suction side of the pump. And there's the pump from Harbor Freight. It's uh, let's get the brand on it, Drummond. So there's the pump. And I got that all hooked up. Got a quick connect. There you go. What quite snapped in. So as you can come down here, we can see we've got the uh, so the pump is primed. There's already water flowing through it. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn that pump on and see what we're gonna get. Now I have ran the pump, but I've never ran it through a, uh, a sprinkler yet. So we're gonna see how far it goes. So it's getting all over the house. Let me move this a little bit. So you can see it's uh, plenty powerful. pump it's not very loud so this kind of is deceiving so at first I thought man that pump sucks it down so quick but since it's open it's uh the suction is actually kind of it's pulling this down some so I can close it but then it stops me from knowing what's going on. But once it gets so far, it'll start sucking through here and start sucking air, and it'll mess up the uh, the suction that the pump is getting. But there's still a lot of water in here for sure. Probably should time it. guys someday actually have this hooked up to a sprinkler system have much way more water storage and be able to uh, you know use this to provide the irrigation for the yard so all this water right here is free water did not pay for it it came out the sky came out of my sump pump but I did not pay for this water grass is kind of high could actually use a cut maybe tomorrow well, guys that's pretty much it this is this is the setup and uh, for now, this is what I'm going to be using. I do have a couple of concerns. 
there's a fine mesh screen at the intake of the inlet of that uh, sprinkler system so I'm gonna take a look at it and if it's all clogged up I might have to figure something out I might have to take that screen out right now I'm not doing anything to um, filter my water at all as you can see I don't have a flush a first flush or anything like that but the a lot of this water comes from the sump pump and it's all clear water it's no it's no uh, debris and stuff in there rake this yard pick up this stuff all right guys that's all I got for now you want to see more stuff like this you want to see how this project evolves over time go ahead subscribe and check me out later